Hey guys, it's TTS Spot here once again. Today I'm showcasing a major layout update. The Act Decoder now supports every PoE2 campaign zone. First, some basics. Hold down the hotkey to show the overlay, and scroll the wheel to zoom. Releasing the key will hide it again. You can lock it in place by pressing space. There are options for size and transparency in locked mode, to make it less obtrusive while playing. For recording purposes, I'll leave it large and opaque. When locked, it will switch between layouts automatically. If layouts have white borders, you have to find specific indicators on the minimap. If they don't match, press 3 to show the next set. If you find a match, press the corresponding number key. This will show the full layouts. You can hide the info box, and select specific layouts by pressing number keys. Some gameplay examples. First, Act 1 Ogum Farmlands. Here, the layout can be identified by checking the fork near the hut. Follow the road to the hut. In PoE2, layouts can spawn mirrored and rotated. Adjust the image to match your minimap. In this case, we have a layout where the fork is not blocked. This means it will lead to the exit. We have avoided a potential dead end, and a lot of empty space. Next, Act 2 Trader's Passage. Some layouts can be identified right at the start of the zone. Some zones have not been figured out, or are too complex or too large for simple images. You will be given rough guidelines for where to search. Sometimes, zones are split into two parts for better visibility. Every campaign zone will at least have sample layouts. These are marked with orange borders, and give a rough idea of what the zone might look like, and where objectives may be found. These will not show every possibility, but you may be lucky to run into one of them.